All right, where are my swords? <clears throat> Let's start uh, with those here. What do we want? So it's good. I kind of don't want slow on it for sure. Uh, melee crit is fine. Melee damage probably not. Do we want to try? Yeah, let's try in uh, removal first. Okay, that's good. That's a lot of forge potential gone, but that's fine. Hmm. How many? Oh, we do have a lot of those. So this is a a pretty cool uh, thing you can get on a uh, two hand. It's a reduced bonus damage taken from critical strikes. A tier five is or can already roll a uh, hundred percent. So if you get a lot of shards of this and uh, goes into Merophage, you actually get your uh, crit avoidance sorted just by that, right? Uh. Let's hit. Hey, Parsec. Ay, ay, ay. We need better. Can we get some crit? No, we cannot, actually. Unlucky. It's alright. They don't have to be perfect. <clears throat> okay, we definitely need to hit removal here. That's gone. Mm-hmm. I'm gonna leave the bleed there. Alright. Okay. Mm, sure. Let's level up first this one. Alright. Stun sounds, yes! <laughs> Alright, this one has uh, this, uh, the, the juice already. Melee crit, very, very good. What do we wanna go for that? Do we go like uh, void damage? Maybe for a void knight? Probably, right? Is bleed probably not good enough, but yeah, sure. Okay. What do we want on a south? Exp yeah, something different. Stun, not that. Sock, not really. Oh, uh, one more tier here first. There you go. Okay. Mm. That's a weird thing with the mid-tier minion spell damage, but I, th I think I don't need that. Yeah, I'm not gonna bother with that one. Alright. Till is fine. Ah, not good enough probably, but sure. Uh, okay. Physical damage and do we want melee attack speed? Probably. Okay, uh, I'm gonna leave that on because you can always use uh, the Salt of Goons uh, gloves for a bleed and uh, crit multi is not a bad thing to have. 
So we're gonna go with uh, physical damage here, probably, right? Or do we want attack speed? No, physical damage probably much better. Okay, that's one. Don't let me down, come on. Glyph of hopes don't work. <laughs> they don't work, I'm telling you. Uh, let's add wait suffixes. Melecrit. So what do we want on suffix? Shred? Probably shred. Okay. That's good. Necrotic definitely not. Crit multi, yeah. Okay, that's not a bad one. <clears throat> okay, good. Uh, this is melee damage, so let's add actually void melee damage on this one. Not bad. Okay, uh, let me drop this one here, which we don't care. Okay, uh, 17. I think all of those are 15 more. This is 14. Love it there. Yeah. Okay. Okay, tier 5, tier 4, tier 3. Horrible. So let's go for a different one. Yeah, I'm not impressed. <laughs> <laughs> oh yeah yeah fantastic I wish when you destroy them it would show uh, how many um, how many shards you would get to get a better idea of uh, what we're getting but this is actually a very good one hopefully we can get a lot of shards on this one Mm, okay. Not very good, generally speaking. Ah, what a sword, what a sword. <laughs> All right. Okay, that's actually not bad. Yeah, that's actually not bad. Melee damage, void damage, straight armor. Okay. Yeah, why not? Yes, you can. Yeah. Every time you're soldering a two-hand sword with this uh, equipped, it overrides whatever it has and grabs the new shards and uh, put them there. That's actually a good one. That's actually not bad at all, I would say. Okay. 
Spin to win? Spin to win? Yeah! Okay. Uh, let's keep this one here. Uh, this one was also good. Probably not good enough. Mm. Do we have Melek? Uh, we don't have a Melek crit strike, so we're gonna keep that. Alright. Let's uh, get the next bats to craft. I mean, the reduced crit is actually pretty good because with uh, with this sword you can just have a, like a tier two uh, reduced crit on your gear sealed, and you are crit capped instantly. So and uh, opens up uh, the Emperor of Corpses uh, blessing to get either resistances or something else you might want. It's actually one of the strong. Uh, affixes on a uh, two-hand sword that you just didn't like it so far but now that you can actually crit, uh, cap, it, cap it very easily from your gear as well it's uh, it's definitely a solid one not the best but okay uh, ignite not okay yeah this I don't I'm not gonna bother Mm-hmm. Cold damage. Physical damage, okay. Health or manly hit, yes. Okay, that's their secret. Uh, all right, my attack speed is not bad. Let me add. Do we add shred? Nah, let's chaos first, actually. See if we can hit something here, and we can add whatever we want. Uh, all right, sure. Yeah. I kind of like this. Yeah, why not? Uh, melee Void Damage, okay. Do we add Melee Damage on this? Or Void Damage? Do they roll the same? Okay, let me check real quick here. Uh, two hand sword. Okay, uh, tier 5 is up to 110. No, Void Damage is actually much better. Okay. So we're gonna go with Void Damage here. And, oh, that was not what I would like. Yikes. Yikes! Okay. Sure. I guess. <laughs> okay, that's tier 7 crit multi right there. Uh, fizz. And give me bleed here. No. No. Uh, maybe. Yeah, sure. I'm gonna keep it. 
right? Yeah, why not? Mm -hmm. <clears throat> uh, this is tier 7 melee attack speed okay give me a good uh, chaos here sure can you use melee fire damage and ignite for something yeah melon health, uh, health on melee hit is um, for the most part a wasted affix for sure all right all right sure why not <laughs> uh, we finish all of them? Yeah. Ah, not really. Is that decent? I don't think so, right? Melee attack speed, melee crit. Probably not. Nah, let's go for something different. Uh, uh, not a big fan, at least decent ones. Uh, let's hit that. Okay. Give me a good one. Tier 6 melee void, tier 5 void damage. Sock is bad. Ah, uh, yeah, yeah. Could have been something. Right. I'm gonna keep them for now, and if we need, we can actually reroll those as well. This is my max uh, roll one. I think that's my best roll. Minus 17 and uh, almost uh, max increase damage as well. <clears throat> uh, no. Okay. Oh, wow. So bad. Okay, I think I have a few more to craft. Yeah. I want to craft this one first. This is a tier 7 melee void. We can uh, definitely do something good with it. Not this one though. Okay, not what I wanted for sure. Uh, add this. Okay, attributes is fine. Sure. Oh. Ah, I mean, tier 6 melee void, but the rest are sad. Okay, I have another one with melee void here. This one has uh, melee vo uh, void damage already, but we need to remove that. Okay, okay. I see you. Okay, uh, reduce damage. And... Do you want shred or attributes? 
Attributes for Void Knight are always a uh, decent outcome. Okay, let's go with Attributes. Alright. Uh, no, this one. Tier 5, Tier 4, Tier 2, Tier 2. Ah, not really. Okay. Let's uh, get the rest of them going. Oh, okay. Fast one. Melefees. Sure. Not really, but yeah. What do we want with that? Hmm. I have no idea. Like physical damage? Sure. I mean, tier 4, tier 4, tier 4 for the bleed. I don't think it's a good one, but yeah. <laughs> it's something. Okay, that's a crit. He has melee attack speed already. Do we go with the bleed here? Oh no! Ah, destroyed! Minus 22 falls in potential. Oh, come on. It's okay. Alright. Sure. I mean, yeah, tier 4, tier 4, tier 4. Okay. Alright, damage over time. I want, well, we need removal first here. Okay, that was fast. That's how we roll. <laughs> okay. Uh, I, I want this gone. I want this gone. Do we try first? Yeah. Ah, okay. Removal or nothing. Okay. I mean, this one is a hot mess already, so I'm not gonna try removing it. Crit? Yeah, sure. <laughs> I guess. Uh, frailty go away. Attribute is fine. Shred is fine. Okay. Okay, that's horrible. Keep that on. Got a couple more. <coughs> Do we go with uh, Cliff of Chaos? Probably. Wow. <laughs> ah, yeah, yeah. Okay. Huh. Bye bye. Okay. Uh, I think we need to remove something here. Everything is bad. Okay, that's one. I mean, okay. F Forge mutation is already gone. Fine. Yeah. Okay. 
Ja, oké. Okay. Tier 7 minion spell damage. I don't even know what to do with this. I I I just don't. <laughs> I, I just don't. Fine. Uh you know what? I think I dropped one short. Yeah, there you go. That's a tier 7 crit multi. And this thing here. Okay. <clears throat> Melee line nomads, crit multi. Okay. These are bad and this is tier 5 already, so we need to do a removal here and hit something good. Right, we hit it. Uh probably not it. Okay. Mm hmm So we want attack speed. Bleed and uh crit. Yeah, damn it, man. As per usual. All right. So this is tier seven straight armor. Now there is a world that you are using uh, a sword like that on uh, a weird rune master frostbite build because you turn your uh, straight armor from all sources into frostbite uh, chance but you kind of need something uh, on the prefixes to help you as well right i am going to attempt a removal for this okay fortune potential gone already of course but we're gonna go with uh cold damage and uh, damage over time and our force mode is already gone okay yeah not really <laughs> all right <clears throat> let's see what we got this is a uh, tier 6 melee damage, tier 5 void, tier 4 shred, tier 3 reduced, decent. Uh, this is kind of fine for Salto Wounds build, but eh, probably not good enough if we're being honest. Melee crit, shred armor, eh. Uh, yeah, this one is also not very good. This is decent. Melee Void and Void Damage Tier 5 is actually not horrible. No usable suffixes, unfortunately, but sure. This had a little bit better potential, but we missed uh, the second suffix. Damage over time for minions. Eh, likes. Okay, yeah, okay. This is actually pretty, uh, I would say pretty alright, but it really isn't. <laughs> okay, yeah. Couple of decent ones, but nothing too insane. Okay. I would say, yeah. Couple of decent ones, nothing too insane. We're probably gonna do a little bit more uh, of that in the future, see if we can hit something uh, very good. It's very interesting unique, uh, I love the concept, uh, it has some interesting stats as well. You can uh, make them uh, work with a couple of uh, weird techs on, uh, on a build, but generally speaking, it, it's a little bit of a generic sort, it's not, you know, uh, build uh, defining, but you can use it, yeah.
Uh, yeah, Void Knight is probably the best uh, for this kind of thing, I would say. I do have a Void Knight, he's level 87. I haven't played him in a while. I'm looking for a nice build for him. So that was one of the reasons, like, if I hit something good here, maybe we do, like, um, a weird spin to win uh, build or something like that. We'll see, we'll see. But, yeah, I think VK is probably the best <coughs> that you can uh, take advantage of this because one of the main uh, defensive uh, layers, let's say, on uh, Avoid Knight is uh, as much high hit, hit point pool as you can and you have uh, incredible leads. So... Lead rate is a nice bonus, it's not a lot, but uh, less damage taken while leading is not bad. 